I don't think anybody has ever seen anything like what happened the other night at Madison Square Garden. The love in that room, it was breathtaking. Many of you remember the Manhattan rally that was hateful and this and that. Robert Reich has put a nice compilation of the video of all of the hate speech all in one two minute clip uh, video. I want you to see it. And uh, it's going to be vulgar language in there. So I want to warn you in advance. But I want you guys to see it because this goes with the message that I made last night that I didn't post this video yet of, of where I shared this lady that we met when we were on the cruise during the pandemic that we befriended. And I want you to see the nasty hatefulness that came out of her mouth as she professes to be a Christian. I'm going to post that one later so you guys can see it. But I want you to see this for those of you that missed that rally, because I just wondering, I mean, some people have asked, well, has anybody spoken out any of these other Christian YouTubers and stuff that support Trump and all of that? You haven't heard anything from them. You haven't heard anything from the many channels that continue to teach and talk about everything else. It's very disheartening because they will pick out everything else. But for some reason, they let this man, you know, have a platform, Mr. Trump and his buddies, and get away with whatever. And then they act like they get whatever the phrase is, gas like they act like stuff has never happened. And this is what's going on. This is disgraceful. It's shameful. And any person that sat there and continues to call themselves a Christian and just brush that off as this, if it's no big deal. You need to evaluate yourself. You need to evaluate your, your heart. And that's what I'm going to show you in this next video, that this woman at 77 years old, uh, she's probably 76 or 77 right now, her heart is, is in a rotten place. And unfortunately, many of these people, as you, that you will see in this rally, you're going to know that they're rotten, that they're, uh, uh, their hearts are rotten as well. So take a look and we'll... Stay tuned because I'll show you the other video uh, as well when I read the, her response. Take care, Evangelists for God is the channel where we take the devil head on, punch him right up between the chops. To the next video, my friends, take care. God bless. I don't think anybody has ever seen anything like what happened the other night at Madison Square Garden. The love in that room, it was breathtaking. That Hillary Clinton, huh? What a sick son of a bitch. The whole fucking party, a bunch of degenerates. Low lives, two haters and low lives. They're smart and they're vicious. And we have to defeat them. And when I say the enemy from within, the other side goes crazy. She is the devil, whoever screamed that out. She is the Antichrist. Her and her pimp handlers will destroy our country. There's literally a floating island of garbage in the middle of the ocean right now. Yeah, I think it's called Puerto Rico. And I'm here by calling for the death penalty for any migrant that kills an American citizen or a law enforcement officer. This country was built on hard work, added value and talent, not on DEI. And these Latinos, they love making babies too. Just know that there's no pulling out they come inside just like they did to our country and the palestinians are taught to kill us at two years old they're on the side of the terrorists it's a cool black guy with a thing on his head i'm just kidding that's one of my buddies he had a halloween party last night we had fun we carved watermelons together it was awesome she got 85 million votes because she's just so impressive as the first samoan malaysian low iq former california prosecutor ever to be elected president don't get me started on my boy tampon tim tampon tim What's up, man? so the first thing we must elect donald j trump president because we must crush jihad America is for Americans and Americans only. So beautiful. It was like a love fest, an absolute love fest.